Ladies and gentlemen, we're all going to feel the wrath of Trump's tariffs on China. You know, one thing you must remember is anything that he hits China with is going to eventually hit the consumer in the pocket. The retailer is not going to always pick up the brunt end of what's going on. You know, if they have to pay higher prices for all of these products, goods and food, you're going to pay higher prices. And just looking at this, I can see how we're going to be in a recession real, real soon. So this is USA Today, August 24th, 2019. When new higher tariffs are scheduled to start on Chinese imports and what may cost more. It is virtually everything, y'all. It really is. Soon, it may be hard to find a Chinese-made product on a store shelf that does not have a higher price tag because of new U.S. tariffs. Trump announced double-barrel new tariffs on China imports Friday, and he did this this morning on Twitter. After Beijing said it would retaliate against Trump's latest duties with its own tariffs of $75 billion in U.S. products. And most of these products are in agriculture. So you think the farmers had a tough enough time just dealing with the natural elements Trump is about to empty out their pockets even more. And this is why they are still whining about not being able to earn the money that they earned even a year ago. On September 1st, which we're not that far away from now, a tariff on some of the $300 billion in Chinese imports that was sla uh, slated to be 10%, now Trump is hiking it up to 15%. It will hit items such as school supplies. Remember, the kids are going back to school in this country. And if you are in other states, they already started school. Sporting goods. A lot of these school children are playing sports. And some clothing, a tariff on the rest of the $300 billion, which target other consumer products, are cell phones, apparel, and footwear. Has been delayed until December 15th, but those two will now be slapped with a 15% tariff, up from 10%. Now, ladies and gentlemen, September is not the only tariffs that are going to be hit on China. There's also going to be more tariffs coming in the month of October. So September and then in October. Meanwhile, an existing 25% tariffs on $250 billion in Chinese imports will rise to 30% October 1st, Trump said. Many are industrial and intermediate goods that will have less impact on American shoppers. It's not clear how much of the new tariffs will be passed to American shoppers and how much can be absorbed by U.S. retailers, but at least a portion is likely to result in higher retail prices is going to be passed on to the consumers. You can best believe it. Here are some of the products that could be affected. Now listen to this list, y'all. September tariff, 15%. So they said these are items listed on 122 pages. 
expected to start in September. All right, let's get ready, y'all. Here's the list. Beverages, tea, coffee, Irish and scotch, whiskeys, liquors, cordials, wine, brandy, vodka, and tequila. Baby gear, diapers, pacifiers, nursing nipples, infant formula, high chair, and baby clothes. Meats and dairies, bovine, lamb, sheep, ham, geese, quail, sausage, milk, cream, yogurt, sour cream, butter, and cheeses. Produce, tomatoes, lettuce, pumpkins, planktons, avocados, grapefruits, watermelons, cantaloupes, and papayas. In the pantry, olive oil, maple syrup, chewing gum, cocoa powder, chocolate, pasta, and condensed milk, clothing and accessories, suits, jackets, pants, shorts, shirts, uh, skirts, shirts, uh, underwear, pajamas, sweaters, dress, dresses, um, gloves, footwear, outerwear, and wrist watches. This is virtually everything out here. Um, live animals, cattle, sheep, goats, chickens, turkeys, camels, rabbits, horses, whales, dolphins, foxes, and reptiles. Miscellaneous, glasses, contact lenses, sunglasses, golf carts, motorcycles, flowers, plants, blinds, shutters, linens, wallpapers, textbooks, dictionaries, books, printed calendars, wigs, drinking glasses, precious stones, iron, steel, aluminum, sewing machines, alarm clocks, grand pianos, musical instruments, brooms, pencils, pens, sanitary napkins, and tampons. Now, it just go to show you how much of the jobs went to China. All of these products that I'm naming to you, all of this comes out of China. All of it, including the livestock and all those animals I named. All of that stuff comes out of China. See, this is what happens when you give your jobs to your enemies. You know, last year I was talking about this. Do you know some old idiot troll? She going to come to my channel talking about China is a good ally to America. I said, you know what? This is why some of y'all really need to get a good education. It, it just go to show you how education in America is a failure. This broad don't even know China is not our ally. You gave all of your jobs to your enemy and you want to know why this is happening. You gave all of your jobs to your enemies. All of it. Now you're at their mercy when it comes down to stocking your store shelves. How stupid is that? But that, is, like I said, is a clear indicator that the American education system has failed this troll. And she don't even know it. She don't even know who the friends are of America and who the enemies are. China is definitely an enemy. Anytime they're flooding your market with fentanyl that's killing your people left and right, and you sitting up there talking about that's our allies, that's our friends, you're a, you're a total idiot. You don't need to be commenting on anybody's video if you're that dumb. Okay, so in October, as of October 1st, there are another a bunch of tariffs. This time the tariffs are at 30%, a 196-page list. So the beverages hit in October will be juices, including 
orange, grape, tomato, and pineapple, beer made from malt, some wines, and water. In the pantry, natural honey. Well, you know, China makes a lot of fake honey. Uh, jams, peanut butter, soy sauce, vinegar, flowers, flaxseed, quinoa, um, oils, dates, figs, and nuts, including almonds, cashews, pistachios, walnuts, and pecans. Produce, cauliflower, cabbage, carrots, radishes, beets, cucumbers, onions, celery, uh, celery, mushrooms, potatoes, Brussels sprouts, sweet potatoes, coconut, pineapples, fresh apples, peas, strawberries, and dried fruits. Personal care, perfume, makeup, shampoo, deodorant, bath salts, soap, water clippers, I'm sorry, not water clippers, hair clippers, petroleum jelly, and sunscreen. So you are relying on your enemy to provide all these things because you gave all of your jobs away. And, you know, it, this goes back to what I was saying earlier in other videos. America always wants something for nothing or they want you to do a whole bunch of backbreaking work and pay you just crumbs. And because this society think and feel that way, that's what drove you to give all your jobs to your enemy. Those, those people over there, they'll work for three bucks an hour. See, that's right down your alley. You get all this backbreaking work done for chump change. Now you're at their mercy for all of these products that aren't even made here anymore. Talk about stupidity, but these folks claim they got high IQs and know more than everybody else. Yeah, well, <laughs> that is still open for debate. Seafood. There's an ocean full of fresh fish, chilled and frozen fish list, um, including bass, swordfish, lobster, tilapia, tuna, sardines, caviar, crabs, crab meat, eels, oysters, uh, scallops, shrimps, and fish sticks. Wow. Miscellaneous cat, dog or cat food. I know some of it comes out of China. Not all. That's one thing. Not all dog and cat food comes out of China. Some of it is still made here, but that's a damn disgrace. You know, I remember back in, because my dog was still alive. Um, It must have been back in early 2000. There was dog food that came out of China. Many of you might remember this. And dogs were dying left and right from eating the dog food that came out of China. They were dropping dead left and right. And with my dog, I gave him organic food and a lot of his dog food I made. I just got a, a couple of recipes on making your own dog food. And I have my own garden. So all the vegetables came directly from my garden. The only thing I had to get was the meat. And what I did was I would make up a big batch of the dog food, you know, using the recipe. And then I got these little um, Tupperware containers and I would fill them all up and stack them into the freezer. And I would just take them out as I needed to, to feed him. Do you know, because I did that on top of giving him vitamins every day my dog lasted for 19 years he died at 19 years old 19 my neighbor at the time had a dog too in fact they had two labradors their dogs didn't make it past 13 i think the oldest one died sooner than that probably like around 10 and the other one died at 13. And you know what he said to me? He said he never had a dog 
last as long as mine. And that was because of the way I was caring for him. But he, everything he gave his dog came out of a store. See the difference? I'm telling you, when you make your own stuff, your pets will last longer. They will. They'll live longer. All right, so back to the list. Miscellaneous dog or cat food, tobacco, cigars, coal, sand, natural gas, metals, paints, ink, film, vinyl, floors, trunks, suitcases, some handbags, gloves, plywood sheets, paper, toilet paper, notebooks, binders, yarn, wool, woven fabrics, carpet, mirrors, vacuum cleaners, windshield wipers, and furniture. Hey, you gave your jobs away, so now you're going to feel the pain. And Apple, this is an Apple store right here. Apple gets all of their products out of China. And they are not exempt from the tariffs, by the way, y'all. They're not. So as of December, 15% uh, of tariffs will be slapped on China. The tariffs scheduled to start December 15th are included in a 21-page list. Tech gear, telephones for cellular networks, video game consoles, LED lamps, instant print cameras, cameras, and microwave ovens, baby gear, strollers, infant nursery monitor systems, infant walkers, booster seats, play yards, and swings, personal care, shaving brushes, hair brushes, nail brushes, combs, hair accessories, electrothermic hair dryers, and electric flat irons, miscellaneous, fireworks, curtains, photo albums, children's pictures, drawings, and coloring books, printed cards, household or laundry type washing machines, ceiling fans, electric blankets, bedspreads, toys for pets, camping goods, umbrellas, music boxes, string musical instruments, cigarette lighters, scales, sleeping bags, toys, magic tricks, confetti, roller skates, and fishing rods. So ladies and gentlemen, get ready to dig deep, deep, deep into your pocket. Ew. Goodness. Ooh. This is what historical figures look like. And these creatures came here raping people, like getting raped by a maggot. Mm -mm -mm. So, ladies and gentlemen, this is how you're going to feel the pain. You don't realize it's virtually everything that Trump has slapped tariffs on. And, of course, China got their tariffs ready to slap back on America starting in September. No defense, but if you can't see how easy it's going to be for us to slip into a recession, you don't want to see it. Plain and simple, you're just being willfully ignorant. But you're going to feel the pain because there's no way you are going to escape all of these items on these lists ain't happening. But please tell me what you think, ladies and gentlemen. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell. And I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.